here I'm supposed to watch for you and watch for you. And go where? <coughs> Behind you all? Any more big rat swarms? Please, not now. Oh, Fuck it. Of course, they were looking my way. What? I could have just rewired the pylon if that was going to happen. Wait a minute, is that... Okay, what's going on in here? Is this the elevator? Yes, it is. Okay. Yes. Let's go to Bro's Lighthouse. Light at the end. It's time to decide their fates. The Loyalist Conspiracy. went well until the very end. Let's see how this goes. Should we gather for whiskey and cigars tonight? Never doubt. Bye bye. Time to take a piss, my friend. Wrong time for that. You shouldn't fall asleep when you are on guard duty like that. Last night, chances are very good. Ah. What's going on there? Nothing. Nice. 
see anyone else out here, so I don't think it doesn't really, doesn't really matter if I leave you there. That's the way in, most definitely. That's the way in, most definitely. The final confrontation, I guess. Burroughs Lighthouse. It's time to rescue Emily. Unjustly dismissed from the name, holding a fair of honor. My friends, the time grievous. I'm almost sorry the moment has come. Our enemies have fallen. We put an empress on the throne who will take years to grow up. And by the time she does, she'll be ours. This is all Martin's fault. If we hadn't helped Corvo get out of prison. Corvo hadn't been so damn good at his job. We hadn't gotten greedy, afraid. If, if, if. Always too sure that was my problem. Never hesitated. Too sure of what I wanted. Too sure of what I wanted to do when other men stopped to consider. Saw it as a weakness. I know Corvo's coming for me just like he came for the others. Crossing the island below like it was nothing. It's only a question of how and when. I'm lacking a counter move. It's all fallen apart. All the steps that led us here made sense. When I was young, I went to sea, took command of a ship, and made aimless men into sailors. Made a collective of boats into a navy. Then founded a conspiracy and almost led an empire. No compromise. Never showed mercy. Never showed weakness. But I showed the world what mattered. Will and vision, and not being afraid of getting dirty. And now, I'll lose it all to a man with a faster sword hand. Or is it that he has a slower sword hand? There's something wrong with the world. We could not have done any of this without Corvo, and for that I will be grateful. But I fear he did not have the vision to see the future we must achieve for Dunwall. He will not maintain our grip on the Empire with a little girl setting policy, and I believe Corvo's loyalty to the Goldwyn women would have clouded his head. Is she truly his daughter? We will take Dunwall to the pinnacle of strength, but Corvo's role in this cannot ever be recognized. He must be vilified, and when I take the reins of the city of the Empire, I will be seen as the hero and the protector. It'll make a good story for the history. I'll have a good epitaph. In his time, he commanded a noble lord, a high overseer. Yes, Emily. The man who brought down a tyrant, Admiral Hammond, son. Oh man. Has he killed the other two? You know, have luck. If if the previous mission would have not failed, and if I had not been forced to kill those guards there in the stairs, I would have not done. What happened to the dirt drop assassination? Yeah, 
killed them. Havelock killed them. Oh man. Yeah, I'm coming, Emily. Who is that? Admiral Havelock? If you don't let me out, I'm going to make you stand in a corner until you learn how to behave. <laughs> Corvo? Just a moment. Just a moment, Emily. What the hell is the key? We've done such things. Cowardly things that I'm ashamed of. How could anyone ever forgive us? Would they? Even if things are better? No, no, that's not how it works. Once the bureaucrats step in, everything gets muddy. If anyone ever knew, we'd all lose our heads for this. So no one could know. And could we ever control Emily with Corvo around? That's the question that's in my mind. We need to make our final move. We need to make it cautiously. No loose ends. Who the hell has the key? What in the world? Not here in the kitchen, is it? No, it cannot be. What the hell? Do I need to go there? Just a little bit confused, not just a little bit. Can't I... Can't I break the door or something? Well, first I fail a nice drop assassination on Havelock and then I know I can't find the key. How's this for an epic ending? And this place does nothing. Wait a minute. Do I have the key already? No. <laughs> no. He should show with this dark vision. Alright. Okay, game, you win. I have no idea. Okay, okay, it's green. Sure, okay. Fail. Corvo! I knew you'd come.
come. Is it going to be okay now? Will I be Empress? I think so. I think so, Emily. So ends the Interregnum, and now Emily Caldwin I will take her mother's throne after a season of turmoil. You will stand at her side, Corvo, guiding her young mind and protecting her from those who seek to exploit her or cause her harm. You watched and listened when other men would have shouted in rage. You held back instead of striking. So it is, with the passing of the plague and Emily's ascension, comes a golden age, brought about by your hand. And decades hence, when your hair turns white and you pass from this world, Empress Emily, Emily the Wise, at the height of her power, will lay your body down within her mother's great tomb, because you are more to her than royal protector. Farewell, Corvo. Farewell, Dishonored. Farewell, Outsider. Farewell, Emily. I guess here at the end credits I could say something about the game. What did I think about it? Um, well, first of all, towards the end, I didn't like the levels as much. They were kind of too, too military. Probably most interesting one was Lady Boyle's party. Well, the last, last hound bits pop part was fun, but I didn't like at all escaping the sewers, escaping from uh, Doubt's, Doubt's place and that stuff. I really like how you can play this game the way you want to play. You can uh, keep it non-lethal, you can uh, try to go stealthy all the way. I imagine the hardest, hardest part would be to go undetected for the whole game. That seems to be quite a quite a feat, and if someone does that, do, goes and does that without reloading, then uh, even better. Yeah, too too bad that I um, there in the sewers, there in the sewers something got killed by accident and that messed up my uh, non-lethal play. Doubt was Michael Madsen, I thought so. I only knew I only knew Susan Sarandon from the cast. But yeah, I uh, I really enjoyed this uh, this let's play. Um, I I liked the kind of mission based design. Um, I still still prefer to kind of open design in general, so um, kind of as an overall experience, not quite on the level of say Deus Ex Human Revolution for me. Um, the levels levels themselves were more more fun than in uh, in Deus Ex, for example, or many many other games. I'm comparing to that because that's the, that's the last kind of a stealthy game I've played. 
And compared to that, this was uh, a bit the mission-based design, very, very different towards the... Than, uh, than the... Deus Ex. As I played stealthily through the, through the game, the experience is probably very different if I go guns blazing and uh, killing everyone. And I think there's also also the kind of middle road, going stealthily but killing. And uh, those um, turning the enemies into ashes will help with that. And uh, Yeah, all in all, uh, very very nice let's play and very nice playthrough, very nice game. Very happy I played this and uh, I really hope you enjoyed watching this. I uh, assume if you are watching watching this video, well maybe you are just checking the last video but maybe you watched the whole, whole thing through. Tell me what you thought about it. If you have played the game yourself, now's the good chance to tell what you think about the game, uh, not to worry about spoilers. And anything because uh, we have now played the game through and uh, yeah we can uh, continue continue from there I will uh, I will probably play Deus Ex a bit more mm, but I think this is my only let's play I won't uh, won't record the other playthroughs if I do any at least I don't think so but uh, yeah all in all very pleasant experience I am happy you were here for the ride with me and uh, I hope to see you in my other videos, my next Let's Plays and uh, all the Let's Plays from there on out. Since I don't have uh, much more to say here, I will uh, enjoy the rest, of the rest of the credits in silence. And I wish you all the best. Until next time, take care and bye bye.